What's up everyone, it's your boy Norrad89 here bringing you another video and you know what day it is. It is happy 420 out there. I know it's the bad boy, pothead, stoner holiday. And just in case, if you're not, you know, you don't partake in this isn't the holiday for you just in case and you're not, you know, but who cares? I brought today a list of a bunch of movies to enjoy for the 420 holiday. Of course, these are horror comedy movies. You know, my, your boy Norrad89 has always got you with the horror movies no matter what kind of holiday it is. And like I said, even if you're not a stoner, or a pothead, you can live vicariously through the characters in this mo in these movies that I got for you. But also, real quick, I got some cool tiny terrors right here. You see these full moon feature tiny terror characters right here, these little figurines. We're gonna unbox them and open them right here live, right now. Special little intro, first of any. So let's see what we got. <laughs> this is <laughs> perfect for the holiday. <laughs> we got Evil Bong right there. <laughs> from the Evil Bong movie, which we might be talking about. We might just be talking about this movie. Let's put her back there. Let's put her back there. And then let's see what else we got here. <clears throat> These are all characters from Full Moon feature movies. So, oh, snap. It's Radu, just in case you guys haven't seen it. Radu right there. Uh, yeah, from Subspecies. We have Subspecies, subspecies Bloodlust, Bloodstone. Radu. We got Radu and we got a little evil bong figure. So they'll be chilling out back there. So let's get to this video. I hope you guys enjoy this one of these movies that I brought to you to celebrate for this 420 holiday. Let's do this. Roll it. So I have a whole host of horror comedy films to talk about today. And since we got our special, you know, edition character right here, Evil Bong, why not just talk about that series right away? We have the Evil Bong franchise that has a whole host of movies. I think there's like six movies or seven movies in total in this franchise. But we have Evil Bong 1, we got Evil Bong 2, we even got Gingerbread Man versus Evil Bong. So there's a hilarious group of movies right there. A fun franchise to dive into, especially for this holiday. You know, they're goofy horror comedies. Don't take them too seriously. You know, don't go in trying to critique everything about it. These are movies that you just need to turn your brain off for an hour and 20 minutes or an hour and a half and just enjoy them. Next up, we have the classic Scary Movie 1 and Scary Movie 2. Those are two that I know that all I always go back to a lot too because that was really the heyday of the spoof comedy, the meta comedy, you know, Scream really introduced a lot of that stuff too, but Scary Movie 1 and Scary Movie 2 and the Wayne Brothers, they really took it to a whole nother level, and I know those are probably easily still to this day the two strongest films in that franchise, and just having them in there, you know, the Wayne's Brothers and all the stoner silly comedy, the horror stuff going on, and like I said, being it that it's very meta horror fans of uh, we love it because it's just they know exactly what they're trying to be and they're not afraid to do it and like I said they put it right on screen and they have so much fun so scary movie one and two two movies that I highly recommend checking out for this 420 holiday next up we have one of my favorites and that's idle hands man because idle hands probably has my favorite stoner character in it and that's Anton. Anton is one of my favorite characters in any horror movie ever and like he's just great and him and the the whole host of cast members Seth Green, Jessica Alba, we have Vivica A. Fox in here like there's a really fun cast. It's a great 90s film. It actually came out right on that cusp of 99 so it's like you know in the heyday of that last hate run of 90s films before we got into the 2000s so Idle Hands is one that I highly recommend. It's got a lot of laughs but it also has some really good gore effects too this is one that they take the horror very seriously there's some scary moments in it and there's some really good gore effects so there's two awesome things besides just the awesome stoner comedy going on in the film so idle hands a strong recommend from your boy norn rad and now last but not least we have cabin in the woods and this one i have on here mainly because one of our you know our final boy character you know that lives all the way to the end pretty much with our final girl you know like oh He's, he's a stoner character, and he ends up being an actually a smart kind of play on, you know, kind of stoner character, one that subverts your expectations, you know what I mean? Isn't the typical kind of character you see in other previous, you know, 80s and 90s and 70s horror movies, and they just get dispatched right away. 
this guy actually goes through all the way and he's actually pretty smart and accomplishes a lot throughout the film. So I think Cabin in the Woods is another fantastic horror comedy that I highly recommend for this holiday. And I hope you guys enjoyed this, you know, fun video of talking about these movies and the fun little intro of unpacking these new characters. I thought it was funny that we got the evil bong one like this. This was just meant to be. This is crazy, especially on the 420 holiday. And then Radu right there, just in case you want to see him again. Radu, we'll get a nice little close up right there. And then we'll try to get a close-up right here, too, of Evil Bong and everything, too. So there you go, right there. <laughs> a fun video, y'all, and thanks for sticking around with me. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Have a happy 420, and please like the video. That definitely helps out the channel. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, and breeze through the channel. I got a plethora, a ton of other videos, live streams, and all kinds of stuff. Like currently right now, I'm doing my Courage the Cowardly Dog deep dives with my buddy Steve. So make sure to check out the other content that I got on the channel. And also, you know, I'll know what's up. Have a safe and happy day. Peace out.